How's it going guys? Um, it is early and I just finished getting ready. Michaela just left to go to work. I just got my food ready and I'm, up, I'm about to go to work as well. Um, today I'm going to try to do a little vlog of my day. I'm going to see what I can do here. And yeah, so leaving the house. So I gotta check. What I do in the mornings is I double check. I just take a look at my tires, see if uh, there's air in them. So, especially this one because it'd be running low. I think that's good to go. Yeah. So looks like my tires are all set, and I can head on with my day. First smoke show in the parking lot. Pretty, pretty smoky. So, yeah, it's doing, it's doing better, actually. It's doing a lot better. Um, like, right now, look. It's not a stick. See, that's not that bad. So, I am, like, almost done fixing the car. You know, it's, it's showing improvements. Um, all right, let me get out of here. Every time I come to a stop sign, the smoke catches up to me and, like, engulfs my car. It's like pretty funny. I'll just try it. See if it does it. Uh, see this? I don't know if you see that. Yeah, look at this shit that I have to go through every day. Look at this shit. Raised grooves. You see this? This thing is ridiculous. This is like my nightmare going through this stuff. Is uh, whenever they're doing work on the street, it's like it's, it comes as such a surprise to you sometimes, and like you, know, you like you don't know what to do because you have all these raised sewage caps on the road. Um, when you're driving this low, you know you, you can't necessarily go over them, and uh, I really don't want to go over my wheel with it as well because I have stretched tires and. The rims are broken out, so I don't want to get anywhere close to them because I'll mess up the rim or I'll crack an oil pan. So it's just a horrible time going through those, and if you do have to go through it, you have to take your super sweet time and not care about any traffic that you start to build up behind you. So that's my little tip for driving low. What? Why would. Why would anybody go under there? Why would anybody be playing with the drive shaft like that to get caught under that? What the fuck? That is hilarious. For those of you guys that do not live in Rhode Island um, that are watching this video, you guys, chances are you guys got it good and that, that uh, tint is legal in your state. But tint is illegal in Rhode Island, unfortunately. The, the, the frustrating thing is, right, Massachusetts, you could have a certain amount of tint that's legal. And uh, Connecticut, you could have a certain amount of tint that's legal. And mind you, Connecticut and Massachusetts are right around Rhode Island. And Rhode Island is only a 45 minute trip from top to bottom. So that's the most frustrating thing is because you see Connecticut and Massachusetts drivers all the time with tent. But if you have a Rhode Island license plate, you're so I don't know. I'm 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 waiting on getting my car inspected and I'm gonna try it out as well. I've I've had tent before on my cars and I've gotten in trouble and I had to take it off, but it's like so frustrating man to, to for that law. So frustrating. So I think my suspension has gone bad due to this bridge. suspension and I think it's because I'm going over that thing every single day. 
to my destination I'm at work so I will um, see you guys after work in approximately a second what's up how's it going I am out of work it's five o'clock it is 90 degrees I'm hot as balls and I can't wait to go home so I'll see you home in like two seconds one second now what's up so i'm home um actually i've been home for a little bit i took a shower already um i did a few things already but michaela's cooking check it out boom get it get it girl get it it was just super saucy i apologize so um by the way the shirt nismo at 8080.com i bought the shirt because it gave me five entries to win a BNR32 Nissan GTR. Uh, check that website out, and if you want to do that, buy it now because they're literally gonna give, they're gonna draw a winner at the end of August. So uh, that's pretty exciting. I hope I win. All right, 8080. But yeah, so over here we're about to eat some dinner. Pretty excited for that. And after we eat some dinner, I have this pretty cool idea with throwing these lights which were supposed to be over our master bed. Um, okay, really Kayla, Kayla changed her idea last second, even after I bought it. So I'm going to put it up there. I'm going to put it right on top of the of the countertops up there. I want to see what that looks like because uh, I'm thinking we could put like some bottles, like different colored bottles up there. I think that look pretty cool. So I'm going to do that after we eat. So what's up? We just finished putting those lights up. Kelly, you want to show, that, show it off a little bit? You have to shut these ones off. In order to see. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Ooh, get it. There it is. So, we really like the way this came out. Um, so, yeah, we just threw the lights up there, turned it on, and that's what it came out like. And, yeah, so now it is time for me to sit my ass down on the computer and write some emails do some research, design a few more projects that I'm working on. By the way, um, that invention is officially patent pending. I don't know if I've said that yet on YouTube. Um, but yeah, it's officially patent pending. I'm excited for it. Now I'm just doing the prototype stuff. Um, that way I could get the video and Kickstarter campaign going and that way I could tell you guys. So keep an eye out for that and yeah, in the middle of working on my computer. I'm working on a lot of projects today, um, a few inventions that I'm working on. So I can't show you guys that. Um, however, I will be working on um, editing the videos. So um, I have to do a little bit of editing today just to I'll edit this video. Um, I'll uh, I have to edit a few other things. Um, but I use um, Final Cut Pro here. This is what you guys saw already. You guys are you guys already saw this a few days ago, but um, I haven't I just haven't cleared it to work on the next project yet. But um, I'll be working on that a little later. Yeah, I'm gonna wrap up the vlog here. Um, it's 8:30 at night. I'll be working on this for a few more hours and probably hit the sack. But I decided to bring you guys in into a typical day in the life of Jerry and. If you guys want to see more of this type of content, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.